It's time! All right, coming up next is the UFC Heavyweight Showdown. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. All right, here he is, the decorated kickboxer, back for more here tonight. And he's so comfortable in the striking realm. It's almost like he started kickboxing before he ever was reading or writing. Oh, it's unbelievable to see someone that's so comfortable under so much duress. I know. When you're in kickboxing range, you are in the fire. There is no safety. You're right in range to be getting knocked out. But he does not fear that. He loves it. He loves the com he loves the combat. He loves the engagement. But what you have to understand is he's not engaging his opponents on their terms. He's doing it on his terms. Whether or not he wants to be in close with the big punches or he wants to be at range landing kicks, he's just constantly putting damage on you. Top, bottom, up, low, it does not matter. This guy is a dominant striker, one of the best kickboxers the UFC has ever seen. And in terms of the punching technique and the jab, as good as anyone in this division. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet two inches tall, Weighing in at 125 pounds, the free. All right, good thing to lose in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fighting. You ready? started here. Round one is underway, and we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is, and this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. All right, he engages in the single-collar tie, and then he lands a nice elbow. Nice kick. All right, here we go, early round one. We talk about wrestling being a great equalizer in MMA, but length and reach is another one. He's got a great jab. We'll see if he can employ it tonight. You have got to be born with it, right? You don't get taller. When you're a tall guy, you have to understand, make your skill set match your physical abilities. And this guy has done this tremendously. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Good punch, Lance. 
how good is this action about a minute in? I think I'm gassing out just watching this thing. I'm exhausted trying to call <laughs> all the strikes that these two men are throwing at each other. What a fun fight. Yeah, hate to be the punch counter tonight. <laughs> well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Big punch from the clinch. And he lands another punch defensively. His opponent's got to do something to prevent further damage. But it comes in bunches. No matter what he tries to do, he's going to answer with more of those strikes. Big punch land. Ooh. And he landed the right hand there. Beautiful hand skills here. The right, then the left. Well, missed on that one. Man, look at him load up on that right. Lee's shot is blocked. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's gonna give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Big ball for punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Lid. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. <laughs> Lee gets hit with a kick. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. It's like in a zone. It's like the basketball who becomes twice its size. This guy today is looking at focus Spencer in his opponent. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach. Just misses with the right. That one appears to stun him. He's in trouble. Oh, he might be out. Ah, oh, that jab hurt him. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Just out of range with that right hook. What a punch. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Misses again with a right punch. And there comes the separation now. Back and forth we go! Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. Knee to the body, it is blocked. The next with a right. Seconds to go. Oh, strong punch there by Lee. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Round two is next. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lot for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. Second round here. Great punch. Slips the punch. Just misses with a left hook there. Oh, he's got that right hand 
going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Oh, spinning back fist out of nowhere. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand. Oh! Buddy. Oh! Oh, man. This ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite stroke in the world on MMA, and he's as good as he gets. The problem is the opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and pound combinations. Back and forth we go. And they separate. Just misses with the right hook. Oh, big punch lands. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of the tape, DC. He had a hook. Oh, and he tags it with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Superman punch lands. Single collar tie now. And they separate. Oh! Oh! No. Huge right hand! Diving punch lands. He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, half guard position here, DC. You have an extra hop in your step when you talk about fighters working out of this half guard. Oh, man. I like half guard as a top fighter. I understand. Oh! Oh, no! Put him to sleep! Oh, big left! And he's back up. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. Wow! That is unbelievable, John. No telestrator tonight, but we're gonna get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moment, you gotta show up. And that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. All right, the official decision is inside the octagon. That's where we find Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliato has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 38 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. <laughs> I'm asking the producers, how soon can I get up? Because it's going to be a party over there. Not only because of the knockout, but that extra bonus check he's going to be carrying to the club tonight.